friends, it's me Cupcake, and I'm here with a Dollar Tree haul. I'm so excited. I got three bags. There's a lot of stuff I want to go back and get. It's been a while since I went to Dollar Tree. Go check it out if you haven't. Go check them out. They have a lot of really cool spring stuff, Easter stuff, and it's Friday, so don't forget to smile. Let's get started. We're just going to grab the bag closest. I want to say this is tea stuff. Yeah, everything in here is tea. He picked this up. So the first thing I got was, well, he got was this White Rain Bonus 24 Free versus 15 ounces Ocean Mist Activation something Moisturize, Nourish, and Protect. It's 18 fluid ounces. It smells good. If you hear a noise in the background, it's because he is in Aaron's room watching TV. He got the same thing. This is the conditioner. This is the shampoo. He actually picked all three of these out. Here, I'll show you. He got all three of the, like, this. He got the set. And he's like, you think you'd be able to tell the difference? He got the shampoo. The conditioner. And then the body wash. So he got the set. And this is all white rain ocean mist scented. It smells good. I like it. It just smells like generic body soap and everything. But I don't mind. I use that. I think everybody uses it at least once in their life. He has an obsession with laundry detergent, pins, yeah, and toilet cleaning supplies. I don't know why. Because <laughs> there are toilets that are dirty. At least most of the time it's not. Because I'm the one that cleans it, by the way. But, yeah. <laughs> Shut up! I do. I'm gonna, I'm gonna clean the bathroom. Don't listen to him. You're gonna die. But yeah, he picked up this. He got a whole blue theme going on. These toilet bowl cleaners. I don't know how good these are. I think these are the ones that make your toilet water blue. That's just kind of weird to me. Very 90s. Got that. He got these blue and bleach. Tablet. Puzzles <laughs> in blue and bleach in every flush. Fresh, clean, scented, safe for septic tanks. Whatever these are. These are tall volcanoes. So you got these two. Like I said, very blue thing. And another thing you got for the bathroom was this. Air freshener, scent thingy. So we already have spray, but he wanted this. Lavender scented. Sounds like Shirley scented lavender air fresh soul gel. Just lavender scents. So another that's what he wanted. The rest of it I wanna say is mine. Wait. Probably we're just gonna go through the bag. So second bag. I got I'm gonna spit this on my nails, but I'm gonna do a taste taste test yes a test on this this is the nail this is nail polish quick dry dry nail polish to high gloss shine new and approved formula this is from diamond cosmetics super dry i want to say is this a it doesn't say if it's a green bar product so here clear nail polish i didn't need some for bad i have nail polish now why did you get pins why did you get the pins? I told you. He has an obsession with pins. I don't know what it is, but he'll have a notebook and he'll write all the bills down with a pen. That's it. And if we are somewhere, I can't say anything because I still have pens too, but they're free pens. I don't oh, just go to the did. store and <laughs> take them, but yeah. <laughs> Ironically, these are blue. I should just call this the blue Dollar Tree haul. Blue. I got me this nail polish remover. 100% pure acetone. I was excited. I saw two YouTubers um, bought this. But I didn't think that my Dollar Tree was going to have it. This is blue. Literally, blue from Dollar Tree haul. And it's 100% acetone, maximum strength, easy remove gel, and glitter nail polish. And... I used to always buy mine from Dollar General because you get like a bigger bottle for $1.25. Do I think the $1.25 plus a little bit extra tax you pay? 
it is worth it. Yes, I think that's. I've always said it's a really good deal. It's a really good nail polish remover. It's dollar twenty-five plus a little bit of taxes, but I was already at Dollar Tree and it's there. So, yeah. But if I had to choose which one, I'm probably gonna buy. I'm probably gonna buy the large one because you get more for your deal. But again, I need need it nail polish remover and and the blue product. I saw. Bethany Bargains, I think her name is. I don't know. That she... Or maybe it's Jay Money. It was some Dollar Tree YouTuber that uh, picked up the Wet n Wild gel nail polishes. They did have four colors. They had one blue. No, three colors. Yeah, three colors, but they had four of the bottles. They had one blue, they had one purple, and then they had two of this, like... The top part looked like a light pink, but it's more of a white color. And I didn't like the other three, so I picked up the only blue one they had. And this was, I was looking at the side of the nail polishes, and it was right there. Mixed in with a whole bunch of different ones. Like, just different LA colors. That if I would have had more money, I'd probably have about ten bags of just Dollar Tree stuff. Like, nail polish, stuff for Aaron, Easter stuff. That we'll be doing as soon as I can. Because I saw so much of just screamed, Cupcake, you need me. Buy me. Nail polish. Like, a few little makeup products. You know, I wear makeup very often. I used to always see my makeup when I did, um, for my tutorials. Obviously, I haven't because I have none. But, it'd be nice to kind of put some makeup on every once in a while. Maybe film tour. Maybe just do it because I get bored easily. And I think my makeup is sometimes fun, kind of expressive. But I don't wear a ton of makeup. As y'all know, if y'all watch any of my makeup tutorials, the basics of it is literally how my makeup goes. Eye primer, eyeshadows, mascara glitter like on the side of my face if I'm going out like little pretty eyeshadow or glitter on the inner tears out to make it sparkle be careful putting glitter around your eyes only use makeup glitter don't use crap glitter it will make you go blind blush chapstick always maybe like some gel for my eyebrows keep them down because I don't like my eyebrows will go in all kinds of ways I'm just weird like that and maybe 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 a lip color and mascara that's it I don't do like the whole foundation and everything I, I can't but yeah I got this one, and this is the Sans, Sans Lamp No Light. This is new, went a while, one step wonder gel. This is, Larry Pacific says no light, so I know that a lot of y'all know plus she's like, you need to do that, you need to do clear um, gel coat and the light, you do not need a light for this. And it's in a black bottle, and this is in, I don't know, I'm going to show y'all, y'all can read that. I'll have the name of the nail polish in the description box. But I actually do not know how to say that. But I'm going to do a test. That's why I left this one plain blue. And if you're curious of what color I'm wearing on my nails, uh, this is in Flirt Revlon 250. I got this also from Dollar Tree on Valentine's Day last year. I did my nails right before I went and had surgery. And this is the nail polish I was wearing when I came out of surgery. So... It's really pretty sky blue. I'm gonna do a taste, a taste test. Oh my god, a test. I don't know why I have the shakes. It's really pretty. I think this is kind of a two coat nail polish. So I'm gonna let this dry. And so far, this is one coat pretty. I definitely would need to put another coat because it is kind of transparent. Not super but I always put two coats even more on nail polish. I know some people are like, oh, I'm supposed to do two coats. Well, if it's not very pigmented you might want to add more, but that's my opinion. It's pretty. I like it. It's looking pretty excellent now. Look who came to visit! My little Stormy. I'm trying not to get my nail messed up. My Stormy wore me. Hmm. Hey, my Stormy brothers. Okay, get up. We'll see if that actually works. I don't know. She must sense, like, computer. Mommy. Because it can be, like, I'm on Pinterest. A bunch of videos. Something to edit. Because I can't edit to save my life. And she just fleets to me. T picked up this crazy glue. Every time I used to put on fake nails, I actually started to get back into wearing fake nails. Always bought my nail glue. Like, just the regular super glue. From Dollar Tree, I think I used Crazy Glue once. I'm not sure, but soon. But if any kind of like super glue you need, go check out Dollar Tree. They always usually have what you're looking for. 
So I got crazy glue. I stuff him on the house. Because he's always asking me, do you have any nail glue? Do you have, like, super glue? Because I always used to carry it with me. When I always had fake nails, I always carried the um, super glue with me. So if one popped off and I was in public or I'm out somewhere or whatever and they pop off, I would just be like, all right, cool. Glue it on there, press it on, go on for my day. Okay. Got a pack of toothbrushes. Yes, I know. Didn't she just buy toothbrushes? I told that to T and he picked these out. We, he's like, look, they come in the individual traveling case and they're like, grossness gets to them. And they have the different colors and three of them, the rip us. So you got a green, a blue, and a pink. So, and this is soft. The last one he got was the um, medium. I don't know if it cleaned my teeth better. My teeth did feel a lot smoother, but I still use it. I used the purple one. But now we got these with little traveling covers and everything. And I was thinking about that recently. That I was like, I think we need to get things to cover our toothbrushes. And if y'all follow me forever, I always buy my like two brushes from Dollar Show. I always used to buy the kids one because they were soft and they were like cute design and everything. They always a little cover. Yeah. See, got this. I didn't even know he got this. Mouthwash blue. Blue from Dollar Tree. That's gonna be just the name of this like video. I'm gonna put that. Where did you get this? Mouthwash. Oh he got mouthwash. A blue theme loofah. I needed a new one. Mine is getting really old and gross. I've had mine since October. And I think you're supposed to only use these for three months. I use mine so they kind of like fall apart. I got mine in like the middle of October. Right before we moved into the apartment. And this one has gold like accents. They have like some really pretty ones there. They have all kinds of different ones. But I like this one. And it reminds me of Jasmine. It's like the tealy blue with the hint of gold. And this Jasmine's colors. And really pretty ribbon. And I found a whole bunch of ribbons that I need for making bows. And I've been wanting to make Mickey and mini ears and stuff again soon. I will be buying. Oh, this says replace every 30 days. Mm. This is just a green power brand. But, yeah. Be using that. I'm going to take my shower probably later tonight. I got some body wash. This is the same brand that I buy my shampoo conditioner from. The shampoo conditioner, it's okay. Like, it it works decent. It's not the best stuff. It's a dollar. But, I don't see my... It makes my hair super soft like I would like, but it's decent. It's not terrible. And it's from the Daily Defense. But I know this is animal cruelty free. It means it does not test on animals at all. I know their shampoo and conditioner is color straight, like, color safe for your hair. So if you have colored hair... I don't know, or you dye your hair and stuff, it is safe for your hair, that's what the bottle says. I don't know, because I'm uh, natural blonde. Are you okay? Yeah. Okay. But you can always find, like, this brand from Dollar Tree, and Dollar Journal will always usually sell these. That's where I used to buy a lot of my stuff, is Dollar Journal. And, yeah, this does not test on animals, cruelty-free. This is good for 12 months or a year. This is an 18 fluid ounce bottle body wash. And it's a shrimp scent bonus. Tropical coconut. They had another one, and then they have soft whispers. So I thought about getting, but maybe next time. But I see which one scent did he like, and he picked up the coconut one. So this will go with my shampoo and conditioner, because I have coconut oil shampoo and conditioner. And the bottle's pretty cool. I like it. It's like white and good. It's like a luxurious look. And then the last thing I got was... Is this the last thing? Yes. What's this? It is a foot scrubber thingy. It comes with nail clippers that I needed. Two memory boards I could use. A nail cleaner. Cuticle pushers in the back. I don't know if you can see that wood thingy. And then two toe depressors I'm going to be using because I'm giving myself a pedicure tonight. So basically it's like a manicure pedicure thingy. They had the zebra one. They had this in purple. These really pretty designs on the, um, the nail files. Memory boards, whatever we'll call them. And then they had a pink one. So, go check out your Dollar Tree. I think this would be great since Easter is coming up. A great, like, Easter basket stuffer. If you have a teenager or a preteen, these are really good to stick in their baskets. Even, like, I think sometimes they have these around Christmas time. These would be good for Christmas presents. Or even if you're, like, doing, like, a birthday present. And you have some, like, girly little touches. This would be really good. I'm thinking about going back and getting the purple one for my older niece and then maybe the pink one for my little niece or maybe I'll get both purple I'm not sure 
But yeah, I think it's a real, honestly, it's really good for a dollar. And I got Sabra because I like Sabra. I almost got, then put this back and got these little nail clippers. It's like, one's got like hand and one's like little toes on it. But I thought this is a better deal to get this. So, yeah. That's everything I got from Dollar Tree. And this is a little bit probably over on about $20, I think, we paid. Okay, I love y'all all. Let me know what y'all, let me know if y'all like these kind of videos. If y'all want me to start bringing back Dollar Tree videos, because I really miss doing this. Also, if you like my haul videos, let me know. If you want to see more of me, let me know in the comment section. If any questions, comments, concerns, or video ideas, let me know in the comment section as well. And who knows, maybe you'll see your, feed, your video idea in a future video. I love y'all all. Don't forget to always read my description box. I always try to leave something kind of fun or like put this emojis or the sing. So let me know if anybody actually reads it. And I hope everyone's having a great day. Day and night, whatever time it is for you. And remember, it is Friday. So don't forget to smile. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you want to become a unicorn. And see more of me. I love y'all all. And have a good night.